everybody, it's John here from VidGimmyAct.com. Here we are today back in Trap Team grabbing the Exhaust All Possibilities achievement. This is to complete the arena battle at the end of Chapter 14 without getting hit by the rocket exhaust. I recommend having a fully upgraded snapshot for this. The game should have came with snapshot. This is late to the game, so you should have him at least pretty well upgraded by now. You want to have him have the uh, spread shot. That's probably the best ability for this. Any projectile character should do so. If you have like Kaboom or someone with the uh, bouncing balls, you will be good too. Anyways, so once the arena fight starts, you want to avoid the areas with the yellow arrows. Pretty much there are going to be rocket exhaust ports there and they will shoot fire at you on the second and third wave. With the first wave, you don't have to worry about anything, but uh, it's good practice to stand here. I recommend having snapshot or anyone with a spread attack. Just stand in the middle and just lean slightly towards the enemies whenever they appear and just start shooting them and you should be good and you just want to keep the strategy up for the entire fight it takes about three to four minutes or so and you should be good another reason i recommend having a fully upgraded snapshot is so you can have some decent health because the lob goblins will give us some trouble because they can uh, throw their lightning grenades over here and they will do some damage not too much because we're playing on easy just to get the achievements of course but if you're playing this on a higher difficulty for whatever reason this part is a little hard especially once you're doing a nightmare run but uh, that's during our second playthrough the playthrough where we're not worrying about achievements and just speeding along through but uh, that's a story for another time just gonna keep standing back and uh, keep firing away We've got the uh, tank dude here just avoid the rocket exhaust looks like that big uh, trail of fiery death and you can get food if you want to, but remember to be cognizant of whether or not the fire is going to shoot out. This is the part that will get a lot of people if you are careless. And uh, just keep staying back and firing away. Don't worry about XP because you should get like a bunch of it in the later levels. And uh, you don't really need it because uh, XP only boosts your health and not your attack. That's what money is for, for whatever reason. And just gonna keep staying back and uh, keep firing away and we should be good pretty easy as long as you stay in this center area and uh, have a nice uh, character with a nice uh, spread shot ability and uh, here we go almost done here and uh, once you finish all three waves the uh, boss should come he is a water villain called uh, threat pack I believe now, if you have a water trap, which the game came with, you can also trap him. If you uh, are working towards your trap 10 villains achievement or your 20 sky stones uh, achievement or whatever you're working towards. But uh, he goes down super easy. Just same strategy. Just stand back. Fire away. If he gets close, you can uh, melee him if you want to. But just focus on him because once he goes down, you should finish the chapter. And everyone else is, uh, doesn't count. But once you finish the chapter, after the last cutscene, you should get the achievement for a 10 gamer score. And that's all there is to it.